welcome back to Hacking and Tech for Student Inclusion. Today, we will be looking at how to use an app called Hypothesis to foster an open, critical environment for your students. First, let's review the essential question that can be answered using Hypothesis. What are multiple ways you are setting up the environment and creating activities to engage and include all students? Let's keep that in mind as you watch this short tutorial. Hypothesis is a simple yet tremendously effective web extension that allows users to create and share annotations. You can find this web extension on Google Chrome. While this may not sound like a noteworthy tool, its simplicity and online-based functionality makes it an ideal tool for remote learning experience to get started. So let's go ahead and try it out. Once we download Google, we have Google Chrome. You go ahead and download Hypothesis. It shall appear, and it should appear on the right upper right-hand corner as the great letter H. And guess what? It's easy to activate after that point. Let's look at an article, an article together. I'm asking my students to read this article on how vaccinations became hip in the 50s, thanks to teens. Here, we'll be highlighting and annotating spots in the text that resonates with them the most. And this article is open, and we need to click on Hypothesis icon to open the sidebar. Here, I created a private group that my students have access to so they can complete this activity. Now that we've done that, we're ready to annotate. So as you can see here, I started by highlighting a spot. It was on a Saturday night. As a teacher, I felt that this particular quote it was a Saturday night in Albany, a small city just east of Battle Creek, Michigan, and teenagers lined up for a dance at the school gym. After I shared this annotation, I then now going ahead to make this visible for my classmates. On the right hand side, I can go ahead, use post examples groups and begin creating an annotation. So it's only visible to me that I can use this annotation. And here I can make personal notes for my students. My students will be able to respond to their classmates annotation in the sidebar as well, while creating a sort of discussion board that can, you can use for a lesson later. If you think Hypothesis might be a good tool to use with your students, I encourage you to upload a PDF, create a free account, and share, and have your students try it out. Try Hypothesis today. You'll love it. 